What's up guys? Um I know it's been a while uh, I haven't been making tutorials and stuff. I'm kind of I'm kind of busy and stuff. So and this is what we'll be creating today. So I want you guys to go in the in the in the description just download this project files and then I have everything for you guys in there. I have, I have a uh, what is it again? Uh, a ring scene. I have some textures that you want to use. Uh, just go to, go to my website and download this project and let's move on. All right. Um, let's open a new a new project. And then we're gonna need a sphere. I think uh, twenty centimeters. Okay. And then we're gonna need a cloner. All right. Let's change it to. And let's increase if the, the size a bit for. And then let's see what we want to do from here. It, I think eleven is okay. And then fourteen. All right. Let's increase the size. Let's increase. Bring it down a bit. I think 139 is cool and then 500 this one all right and then random effect all right there we go and let's increase this to 100 100 and then down here 35 in the scale uniform scales minus uh 0 0.5 all right just zoom in a bit you're good to go. And then let's duplicate this. Let's go to the cloner and bring the size down about uh I think 10. And then we're gonna have to use uh to create a new uh random effector and then bring it Bring it here, go to the clone effector and delete the first guy. Alright, there we go. Alright, let's go to the parameters. You're gonna bring this about minus 10. And then this guy 30, 39. You go to the scale, uniform scale, go to minus 0 0.5. All right, zoom in a bit. And then I'm gonna go back to the project file, not this one. Um, and I'm gonna copy this. This uh send ring you can download it down there. I have the project file for you guys already. Let's go back to the project, and then I'm just gonna paste it in here. And then here we go. Now let's preview this. Done. And then let's uh 
We're gonna need a new shader. Then I think uh, let's go for let's try let's try red to be like red and then and I come here change to bring the roughness down, increase the reflection, not too much, just a little bit. And then we're going to use glass, all right. Okay, we're good to go. I just put it to the first corner. Where is it? I think it's this one. All right. Then I just preview that. All right. Like, it's taking a lot of time. Let's just create a second shader. And then we can call this glass. Let's just bring the color down a bit. Uh, go to the transparencies and then uh, change the preset to glass. Bring this down to 50%. And then we we'll have to bring. I don't think I think uh we don't need the color. We just remove that. Do we need it? I think we do, right? Just bring it back to the hundred. Nah, no, just think you're good to go. Go like that. And then we're gonna put it to the second corner. And the last thing we're gonna do, we're gonna have to create this uh, uh create this line. This line here. Let's go back. And then let's grab this, let's grab this ellipse, and then let's change it to just uh, zoom back a bit. All right, there we go. Now we have that guy, bring it down a little bit, and then increase the height. And then go to the start angle. Let's increase that a little bit. And then go back to the height and increase it. Alright, zoom in back. Just zoom in a little bit. And now we we're gonna have to create a a profile for this guy. We're gonna have to create a profile for this. And this one, bring it down a bit, and then right, and go bring it to boom, good to go. Let's create a new shader. Oh, using a little glass material. And then let's go to reflections. And then class, bring that down a bit. Alright, and then just put it here. There we go. Let's just preview that.